hello Romans and Galatians students. Welcome to the course. So excited to have you. My name is Josh Rice and I sent out a separate introductory introduction video about me. So I'm going to dispense with all that and really uh, just walk through the guts of the Romans and Galatians course. I'm excited about this course because I recently had the opportunity to rewrite it in a way that I think is much more student friendly and makes the workload um, much more reasonable as well. So we cut some things out, we changed a textbook, and I think it makes for a much better experience for students. Uh, so if you want to go ahead and open up the syllabus on uh, the home page, I just want to talk about course assignments, what I'm looking for, so that you can be confident as you begin the course. There are two textbooks, technically three textbooks for the course. The first is by Peter Oakes, and it's going to be on Galatians. We'll spend the first three units of the course walking through Galatians and reading the Oaks book. Now, the good news is it's not a long book. It's a short commentary, and it's easy to read. I personally selected this book because I think it's engaging. Uh, it's not overwhelming you with content that you have to read. It's appropriately aggressive, and it'll be uh, fun to uh, really dive into a new way of looking at Galatians. Uh, by using Peter Oakes. Uh, the second is a two-volume set by Lyons and William Greathouse on Romans, and we'll be spending units four through eight tracking through Romans. Now, obviously, these documents, Romans and Galatians, are among the most influential pieces of literature in all of Western history, and we're covering them in eight weeks. We are, at some level, simply going to skim the surface, especially when you take into account that we're throwing in some extra articles and video content each week. So it's going to be a lot, but I think you're going to find elements of Galatians and Romans that really pique your interest, and I want you to pay attention to that interest so that you can form your research paper around those elements. That being said, let's talk about the research paper and the other assignments. Each week, you will have uh, one, I think in most cases, one discussion post. Again, I was able to cut that down from the former manifestation of the class. What I'm looking for in that discussion post is weighty engagement with the reading from Peter Oakes, from Great House, from one of the articles that we're going to read, but I'm really looking to see that you're digesting the reading and thinking through it. I read every post and I comment on every post. And initial posts are due each week on Saturday by midnight, which gives us two days to then comment on one another's posts and to create a sense of classroom community around the material. Also during the course, there will be several reflection papers in which you'll simply be reflecting on the reading. I'm looking for the same thing, and that is engagement with the readings. And here's a hint. If you do your discussion posts really well, you can reuse, reframe that material for your uh, reflection papers and do very, very well. So keep that in mind as you move forward. And finally, the, the other major assignment for the course is a course project and I have constructed the course project so that you are doing it in pieces in order that I may coach you along the way. Uh, my hope is that I can help your research and your writing be more focused and be more efficient so that you're spending less time wasting time and more time really getting the job done. And you'll notice even in week one, uh, your, your role, your job in this regard is to simply choose a topic so that I can coach you up on that. So that's, those are the major assignments. That's what I'm looking for, and I'll be with you every step of the way to coach you. Meanwhile, if you have questions about the syllabus or the preliminary assignments, please let me know. I'm here to serve you, and I'm invested in your success. Let's have a great start to the course together. Thanks.